Hi Sagittariuses, this is Michelle with Belladonna and Moonbeams and I'm coming to you from my house with a blank wall. OMG, why is my wall blank? Well, if you remember, I used to have a mirror back there and I love the mirror, but um, it would reflect and so it kind of messed up the camera. So I decided to, that it had to go. So anyway, I got rid of it. And now I have a blank wall. So if you have any ideas for what to put back there, let me know. There's also another change happening, which I'm really excited about. And that change is, instead of being Belladonna and Moonbeams readings by Michelle, it's going to be Belladonna and Moonbeams readings by Genevieve. And you're going, what? Who's Genevieve? I'm Genevieve. My birth name was Genevieve Elizabeth. And so that is going to be as it were, my nom de plume or my pseudonym. And because I need, so there are moguls out there, moguls being non psychic people or non magical people who don't like the fact that I'm doing tarot readings online. I think it's silly, but whatever. So rather than argue with the muggles all day long or worry about the muggles saying bad things about me, yeah, I hate to have th bad things said about me. Um, I just decided to separate the two. I can have my muggle life and my psychic life, and they're just part different per parts of me. Just like I have a birth name and an adopted name, but they're both me. That's really cool. So anyway, we're going to start out by reading, pulling a card from the Magical Unicorn Oracle deck by Doreen Virtue. Doreen Virtue is very talented. So anyway... What do my Sagittariuses need to hear for the week of June 22nd, 2020 to the week of June 28th, 2020? What do my Sagittariuses need to hear? What do my Sagittariuses need to hear? And the card I get is you are gifted. First of all, look at that gorgeous unicorn. And second of all, you are gifted with many talents that you, you may not even have tapped into. You need to own how wonderful you are, Sagittarius. Own your glory and your talents and who you are. Own it. And now we're going to read from the um, Rider Waite Tarot deck. Once again, if you ever thought about reading, this is a deck to read from. To start. Once you're good, you can read from any deck you want. So what do the Sagittarius's need to hear? What do Sagittarius's need to hear? What do Sagittarius's need to hear? The first card we get is Strength. So I think this week to own your self, to find, to find your gifts, to own who you are, is going to require some strength. That's not a bad thing. It just means you've got to own your strength, your, who you are. The second card we get is the Three of Pentacles. And this is all about um, like a merchant um, doing business with some other people. And you're like going, what does that have to do with the other? Well, I think you've been hiding your light under a bushel for a while. Uh, and I think this week you're going to own your gifts. And people are going to recognize you for owning your gifts at work. Um, and, and maybe you'll even get a promotion. Um and you can also, this is also about a group. So you might be working with a group this week. And your final card is the Six of Wands, which is all about victory and celebration and a public victory and celebration. So if you own your gifts, if you admit, I'm the one that wrote that project, and you have the strength to do that, you might get a promotion, and you're going to get public acclaim for it. 
but you have to own it first. And you've got to own it. You've got to own just how wonderful you are. And I got to tell you, Sag, you are wonderful. Own yourself. Own your glory and your talents. So this is Michelle coming to you from Belladonna. No, silly me. Start over. This is Genevieve coming to you from Belladonna and Moonbeams. If you want to do a private reading, it's 405-512-9400. Send me a text or go to my Facebook page, Belladonna and Moonbeams, readings by Genevieve, and send me a PM. Talk to y'all later. Have a good week, and I'll see you next week.